We're live. Hello. <laughs> hello. Hello. The man, the voice. Can hello. you can you say hello? No, hello. Hello. <laughs> hello, everybody. Welcome to the um Decoupage Queen and Andy Skinner part two collection. Um Yay. reveal. Yes. Yay! Exactly. Yay. Yay. So um Presented to you by a myself and the man, the legend himself, Andy Skinner, who is a oh, um, voice in the background. <laughs> <laughs> and um, I promise I will stop talking <laughs> at some what point. Lost <laughs> Teresa doing in here? I know, right, Teresa? How rude! <laughs> How rude! How rude. <laughs> Hello, Sue. Hello, Teresa. Hello, Cynthia. Um, hello, Callie, Brenda, Diane. She's lurking. Teresa says she's lurking. Oh, yes. hello. So today we have a very, very, very exciting um, release to show you guys, a mini release of 12 brand new papers, brand new designs brought to you by um, Andy Skinner and decoupage queen and so today we're going to have a look at them and he is going to tell us a little bit of a give us a, the inside scoop um about some of those papers maybe i'll, uh, try, I'll try my best <laughs> yeah exactly and with all of that as well um we have a bit of a giveaway uh, to celebrate this release so um we will be giving away one set of the full collection, so all 12 papers for one lucky person, plus a very, very, very exclusive um, creation from Andy Skinner himself um, with some of those new papers. So Andy, can you tell us a little bit about that box, please? Yeah, it's a combination of three of the papers. And it, it's, a, it's a wooden box, square box, and you may have seen a sneak peek uh, on my social media the day before yesterday. Mm. Uh, so a couple of the papers have got quite a Japanese theme to them. So I combined two of those together and collaged them with one of the paper, which is the mixed media paper, which you'll obviously see in a little while. It came out quite cool, I've got to admit. Yeah. Um, so yeah, that's up for a giveaway. Um, and 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 we, um, I requested specifically that Andy will um, sign it, address it to one of our winners, right? To the yeah. winner, right? So not only you're getting a an exclusive piece um, from Andy, but it's going to be also signed and all of that good stuff, right? And posted to you. Um, so in order to enter the giveaway, what we would like you to do is share this live stream and tag a friend and I will pop your name on the spinny wheel. Um, and at the end of the, at the, end of the <laughs> stream, we're going to spin the wheel and we're going to find out who is going to be the lucky winner of the box and the um, full set of papers from... Yeah, um, Maz. Of course you can enter. I don't think there's any restrictions on people that are on the design. No team. restrictions yeah. whatsoever. No. no Hi, Rachel. Hi, Art Angel. Hello, everybody. Okay, so um, in some moments, fair warning, in some moments, if I do go a little bit uh, <laughs> typey typey, that's because <laughs> I'm also typing the names at the same time. <laughs> um, so, Andy, that's your hint, hint, hint. Um, to take okay. over right, and, and talk <laughs> about the papers. I didn't sign um, up for that. What? What do you mean you didn't <laughs> sign up for that? <laughs> did you not read the fine print? I didn't. I never do. Oh, see, but there's only one person to blame for that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Teresa. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to switch over to... um to this view so you can see the papers a little bit better and we're going to reveal them all right are we ready is everybody ready are we all ready are we all ready oh <laughs> <I'm> sorry <laughs> i can't hear you yeah 
You can't hear me. No, I can. I meant they're not. No, carry on. I can hear okay, you. Okay. Okay. Panic, panic, panic over. Panic. Okay. <clears throat> so, um, ta -ta -da -da. so we have a um, brand new collection of 12 papers. And so this first one that you can see here is an absolutely, absolutely beautiful um, paper to start off the collection called Floral Collage. And it is a absolutely, I just, I can't like, the way that it looks when you look on the, um, like on the screen, right? When you just see the paper on the screen, it does not even translate like to, to how it come out when it's printed. It's beautiful on the screen, but like when it's, as soon as I saw it, I'm like, I need, I need, I need, I need multiple copies. Thank you. <laughs> so can Andy, you, can you tell us a little bit about this? A bit, you probably see the place you get to it with the camera. Yeah, it is different. So we have some lovely, lovely, what flowers are these? These are, I'm not very, um, educated in the flowers <laughs> in the flower me, department me either i did know at the time uh-huh can't they're a kind of kind of daisy type flower right exactly yeah oh. so it's a there's like daisy and there's lots of beautiful colors i just absolutely love how they the colors flow right the blues and the yellows and it's so like yeah just gives That's me kind of my colors brady it's like a prussian blue mm -hmm. uh, a bit sort of queen gold uh, type color, burnt umber, a little bit of, I call it burnt orange, quinacridone and burnt orange, but those are the colors I put in there. But like you say, if you actually get the paper in front of you, like Yvette said, you can see all the collage work in there. Right, yeah. But and there's, there's the text, the print. There's the, the text. Yeah, yeah, you can see right a little there, Right, yeah. And like you can see some, obviously, almost like headlines, right? Um, Royal Ballet um, and um, also script and some other bits and pieces and it's very 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 detailed um, so so that's our paper number one I'm gonna do the whole I'm gonna move it it's off quite complex. <laughs> because I'm, I'm not very good at <laughs> changing the papers like that like T Teresa knows it Teresa's really good at doing it also so quickly and <laughs> She's a pro. I'm just learning. Okay, so paper number two, Floral Cascade. And again, isn't it just gorgeous? Look at the, like the blues and the whites and there's some cream in there and almost like towards like yellowish and browns in some places. And it's some script, right? And um, just, yeah, again, no idea what these flowers are. But this this one is also very very like um, Japanese feel, but not so much, I guess. It's, yeah, it's not so much Japanese. Not, like, I mean, I, just a vibe. <laughs> so people probably didn't expect me to do. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, more of a a, a grungy floral warp. Um, floral. Oh, okay. Right, Andy's signal is cutting out a little bit here and there. That so, with credit because really get that into a. Okay, so Andy's. Yeah, um, I, I'm back okay. again. Could you repeat that? <laughs> Sorry. We have a... uh, I was talking about, yeah, a few years ago. I some... Can you hear me? Yeah, yeah. I can't hear you. Yeah. Thanks. Yeah, I released some stamps, and they were floral grunge backgrounds. Uh, Background floral stamps. Yeah. No. Okay. So this signal is cutting out again. Um, so I tried to pull. Yeah, we're losing the no, audio. I can hear you, but I can't see anything. Oh no. What well, sorry. Sorry, you guys. We're having uh, technical difficulties with um with signal. 
um, and Wi-Fi, I guess. <laughs> um, Lynn is asking, in the meantime, Lynn is asking, where can I buy in the UK? So we have several retailers in UK. Um, and I just posted the link in the comments um, to our retailer locator. So if you go onto the retailer locator, you will be able to see um, the retailers that have them in UK. So you can check with them. Um, Yes, Andy, can you, are you back yet? Nope, okay, we can't, no, can't hear. Back. Okay. Are you back? Okay. It's that signal. Ah. It's that signal. Hello, Miriam. Okay, so <clears throat> in the meantime, so. From what I gathered, um, this was um, inspired by the um, by some um, stamps, right? That Annie purchased um, a few years back. Um, maybe if we keep getting these like issues with the signal um, and audio, uh, maybe we'll just quickly go through the papers today, and then Andy can write us up a little. A little backstory for each paper, and then um, you'll have to look out. Can you hear me? Oh, yes. Yes. Yeah, I'm back. back, I think. Okay, let's yeah. give it a try. <laughs> okay. Let's give it a try. So, okay. Um, moving on to the next paper, we have... Um, Tattered teal. So again, this is just such a gorgeous paper, isn't it? Um, it can very like Asian um, vibes um, due to the colors and the, the flow of it. But at the same time, it doesn't have to be like you can you could use this for literally anything. Isn't this just? Mm. It's a it's a kind of grungy grungy wallpaper look again. Right, yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, but this collection I've gone a bit different to last year. Um, very different. Very different, very. yeah. I didn't want to just bring out the same kind of thing. So, And I do love old wallpaper designs. Mm -hmm. Me too, me too. They're, they're just perfect for, um, like, I don't know, you can use them as backgrounds and you can use them as the main kind of decor right piece you can they're yeah. just so versatile compared to if you have like a paper that has like a main or a load of yeah you you, you can use it like you say as a background mm -hmm. you can zoom in all mm -hmm. sorts with tags it looks great would turn up like over the next few weeks we're all going to be posting up our um our final pieces mm -hmm. so you'll, i think you'll see that one used quite a bit I think so. I think so. I know that Teresa has done a piece with one of the. She <laughs> has. I've seen the sneak peek, which. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I can't wait to see the full, full, full piece. Um, well, I'm lying. I have seen the full piece. <laughs> 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 um, okay, moving on to ah, uh, this one. This one is. I I know that there's going to be a lot of people that are going to love this one. Not only do we have. Um, a lot of like neutrals that are like even more versatile but also we have florals and harlequin and grungy are you kidding me all in one package <laughs> <laughs> so, so how did this happen well this this paper was designed a while ago mm -hmm. um and so if you look at it, it's like a, a distressed plaster wall. So where you see the harlequin yeah. is yeah. where the plasters come away and, and then obviously the wallpaper staying in place between the, the plaster. I think there's some script on there. Um, uh, yeah. I'm, I'm not sure there was some. But yeah, as you can see, like this. Yeah, there's a little bit on there. Plastered, yeah, that's what I was going to say. Like, what happened to this to this um, wall? It almost looks like again, like yeah, you or like wallpaper that's like somebody the ripped it. Away. Yeah, yeah, come away, and then it reveals this beautiful like cemented wall with more florals, but also harlequin underneath. Um, 
Okay, moving on. And selected by Teresa, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and so, yeah. Why am I not surprised? How am I not surprised, huh? Um, so next up we have Andy's floral four pack. And so this um this one is just a a nice little paper um that has all four of the designs. You know, I'm so glad that that um we've done this in the like A6, I would say. Mm -hmm. right? Yeah, 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 yeah. So the, the ones that I've got, I've just used them all because I tend to do smaller pieces. Yeah. With the papers, like on a tag. And, and yeah, so I've, I've used nearly every one. They're, they're just so versatile for, for us, really, for, for doing our mixed media stuff. Um, right. Yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly. Uh, th these are, and, um, oh, um uh, before I forget to to mention that, like the whole selection, um, of the selection, the whole collection, um, is going to be available in all five sizes, right? So you can get all papers in sizes A4 through to A0. So technically, with like these four packs, right? You you can get these each of these papers as small as A6 size if you get an A4 of all four of them. And then you get an A3 um, paper, which is going to double them all, right? So then you have A5s of each one of them. Um, so that, in that sense, it makes it very, very like you can get these designs in any size, pretty much. Yeah, so. I just love this this new smaller size that we didn't okay. have last year. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Kelly Cat says, "I need to do furniture with these five. <laughs> <laughs> And Teresa says, yes, seven sizes instead of five. Exactly. Exactly. Hi, Leanne. Oh. Hi, Leanne. Um, so next up, we have um, Dusky. And this is just, again, it's such a beautiful, and uh, the name Dusky really, really, really fits it. And this is where we head more into... Um, in oriental. oriental yeah um theme we lean more into it rather than like the, the first the floral ones are just kind of like yeah we have a bit of that vibe here but the next four are where we're gonna really 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 um lean into it so we have some i don't know what would you call these that it's almost like palette like these remind me of like palette yeah, knife. Kind of palette knife uh, yeah. Lilies. yeah, 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 yeah. Beautiful. And it's again very, very grungy. Like I love the fact that in the background you still have that. It's very reminiscent of like the previous collection, um, with the colours and the grunginess of it. But then you also have the the theme yeah. here going on. It's just very different. It really. is. Me, I like the the symbols on it. Um, the box that we're giving away. This is one of the papers that's used on that. Mm -hmm. When you'll see mm -hmm. it on the box. Uh, again, versatile. Very, very versatile. Which, um, by the way, um, for those of you that have just joined us, um, we're doing a giveaway of a full set of papers from this collection plus a. Uh, a very exclusive piece of um, artwork, I would say, with these papers from Andy Skinner himself, um, signed and posted to you, to one of the winners. Um, so um, if you would like to enter the giveaway, all you need to do is share the live stream, tag a friend, and let me know in the comments so I can add your name to the giveaway. Just a little getting my spiel out. <laughs> Um, okay, so next up we have um, Andy Skinner, Japanese. Ah, here we go. Sorry. Uh, staying in the frame, staying in the frame. <laughs> Andy, come on. You have to let me know. Sorry. <laughs> I, was really looking at, I was looking at the comments. Uh, okay, somebody has to keep traveling. Uh, Brenda says, I love the tattered teal and the florals. Thank so you. This paper, mm. I, just, I love Japanese. Uh, one of our design team, Dee, also likes Japanese, and she's done some amazing 
um, samples using this paper, which I love. I just knew that she would be drawn to this paper. Uh, these are vintage Japanese postcards I put together in a, a kind of collage. Um, we've got a little bit of gold leaf, the little kind of swirl. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. In gold leaf, you'll see the Japanese stamps. So they're, they're all postcards from around about the 1940, 50 um, era. Interesting. Again, it's yeah. just so versatile. You, you can rip it up like I've did. And that, that's the second paper used on the box. So you'll see parts mm -hmm. of that paper. So on the on the box in the giveaway, we're going to have giveaway box. Yeah, of these. It's just a very very beautiful paper. But again, like you could use these, like these could be used as like little pieces of ephemera in themselves, right? You could yeah. um just use elements from it or use it as a as a a piece. In its own okay next one next one um you guys get ready because i absolutely i absolutely love this next one here can you have a tiny little oh the white one's beautiful <laughs> i know <laughs> <laughs> my favorite <laughs> so versatile <laughs> i know okay so this one um it's called sumi sunset if i pronounced that correctly i hope yes uh, i'm just I I I want to frame it and just just that's <laughs> it. <laughs> so do you want a bit of history? Pardon? Would you like a bit of history? Yes, <laughs> obviously. For them, um, for those that don't know, I used to be a ceramic decorative teacher, uh -huh. and um, I did lots of courses on sumi painting. And then putting that sumi painting onto vases, plates. Right. Uh, so this is sumi painting, but with watercolour. Uh -huh. uh, okay. And once you've got the technique of sumi, take a look into it. it. It's a lovely technique. Really, really lovely. And it is, once you've got the technique down, there's so much you can do with it. Bamboo with just a couple of strokes and... That's so cool. So is this um, your it is. painting, like all of it? Yeah. That is just amazing. Wow. Well, I had no idea. <laughs> mm -hmm. Well, I wanted to post that up on the internet when I did it. Right. I was, well, okay. actually, it's like, like a nice paper, and if I post it up on the internet, that is... then there's the, it's gone sort of thing. So. That is absolutely gorgeous well well um that's um a testament to just how you know how good you are clearly at, at this this is just so there you go you guys if you um if you choose to use this paper or get this paper for yourself you're not just getting like this is this is like it's almost like an art print in 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 a in the truest form that you can choose to frame and put on your walls or you can actually like do something with it and put it on something else without having to paint it all yourself <laughs> though i'm assuming andy could uh, probably teach us <laughs> you need to do a class for all of us <laughs> i know i know i i think i did years back after i stopped teaching the ceramics uh -huh. um, i did introduce something into a class but it's quite difficult you got to learn the techniques and to do it in a for someone to learn the technique in a a, a day or it's not gonna yeah. work you know so yeah. it really needs yeah. to be you know you need to go on a a of week's course. course really to to master it but i'm sure there's online it's probably online stuff now on youtube where you can learn the art of, of japanese sumi painting um, I'm sure. I'm sure there will be, but it's, I right. guess it's just like with any um, painting or like ceramics or anything like that, right? Where like it's a skill that you need to develop over time. You can take. I, so. but... I mean, if you if you learn it like I did on ceramics, then you've got to learn because when you paint, um, let's say bisque pottery, yeah, it's so absorbent. Yeah. Uh, Right. Sumi painting, it's all about the amount of water you're putting on it. And you spray the water on on a bisque, 
pot or a, a plate and it soaks in really quickly. So the technique's even more difficult on ceramics, but yeah, on walls, color paper, it works yeah. really well. That's, that is, well, that is just absolutely amazing. That is, yeah, like, I mean, there you go, guys. There's a reason why I was instantly drawn to this paper. I'm just saying. <laughs> so um, uh, I saw a comment from, who was it? Brenda. Brenda was asking, what is that one called again? So this one is called Japanese Sumi Sunset. Sumi Sunset. Japanese Sumi Sunset. Sunset that's it. Yeah. So there you go. And then who said it? Laurie said, need this one in A0 on my wall. Yes. Yes, Laurie. Same, <laughs> same, same, same. Um, Teresa says, for the first week, the only way to get these will be through a retailer. They will be live on our site next Saturday. Yes, exactly. So, um, uh, and here is a link as well. Thank you for the rem for the reminder. Uh, can, I, can I just give a, a uh, quick link yeah. out? Yes. Um, so if you go on to my website, which is andyskinner.co.uk, Mm -hmm. um, and go to the products and there'll be a link to decoupage queen in the uk and also a sorry in the us and also a, an english supplier uh -huh. um, in the uk which i've now been able to do where last year um i didn't really know who who the suppliers were yeah, I just posted the link to Andy Skinner's website. So there you go. If you, um, for those of you that are looking for these papers, check out Andy's website um, or like a direct. Yeah. Um, right there. Direct list of all of the people that stock them. Um, okay. So that was um, that one. And then we have this beautiful number. Huh? See what we <laughs> it's called number jumble, and um, oh, I'm guessing it goes kind of like that, but I mean, yeah, again, you could yeah, anyway. use it in any way, <laughs> it's just beautiful. So, um, a little bit of background, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah, it's, uh, it's just a number jumble, That's just it. okay. <laughs> <laughs> So it's color. Everything needs to have a deep meaning behind <laughs> it. A, it's a collage. Um, really, a, a bit of, again, there's some flora in this as well. Um, yeah. I just love that kind of distressed wall look and the, the paper peeling. Yeah. You know, old posters that have been posted over each other and, and torn back. So, yeah. That, that was the yeah. kind of look I was going for, really like a, a collage of, of posters imagine yeah it being on a wall and where one's been posted up and where one's been torn back and no one posted up exactly they're like they're very layered and nobody's like taking the time to you know like peel it back no that's right yeah, yeah. you got that kind of look cover it up cover it up <laughs> <laughs> no but Again, that's it's just different it's different, yeah yeah you know? it is it is it's very different. It's, it's and very that's beautiful. in the smaller size as well, I think, in the, mm. the A6 yeah. size. So, yeah. Yes. So, the next one here is um, another four pack. So, this is an Eastern four pack. And again, um, same story as with the floral um, four pack. All four of these available in A6 size, right? Um, not just A4s. Yeah, I've done a, a tag with the A6, the Japanese one. Mm -hmm. um, I've done a tag just using that paper on its own on the tag. This uh, one? Yeah, which I would be posting yeah. up in the next week or so. Uh, but it looks awesome just on its own. Right. Sorry, it sounds really big headed, but it does. <laughs> it just... I mean, well, no, it is. <laughs> it, yeah, it is. It, it's it like there's loads of work going into it and you've collaged this on, but um, mm -hmm. but you can add on to it. If you look at the Adams's, uh, uh, I'm sure her samples we posted out over the next week or, or so, and look, yeah. look how he's grunged it up and added um, 
I think it's triply embossing that she's done a lot on them, and they, they, they just I, I love what she's done with it. Yeah, yeah. That's one beauty when you you do papers, isn't it? You you see what other people the ideas they come up with it, which oh, you absolutely. never thought of. Absolutely, um, it's um... So, come on, everybody! I want to see what you do with these. <laughs> yes, we do, and obviously we will be posting. Uh, you'll see a lot of. Um, kind of um, project done with these um, from our kind of decoupage queen, Andy Skinner, friends and family group, right? That got um, an exclusive kind of access to these papers a little bit earlier. Um, so to inspire you, but what we want more than anything else is to see you make things with these papers. So um, get the papers and get creating and then show us because like that that is inspiring very inspiring back yeah. to us <laughs> the create papers <laughs> thanks carly okay so and then moving on to the last two which kind of like stand on their own really um but at the same time, still fit in very well into the collection because we need a little bit of our um, like your your traditional Andy Skinner, right? <laughs> and here we have um, vintage plates. Uh, I love it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I actually, well, you know, I, I needed more of these. Ah, uh, uh, okay. <laughs> I'm in the middle of an electric guitar. Um, yes, yes. Really, um, really cool. Um, but yeah, I've just used it on so much. Uh, and the design team have used it quite a bit. Maz has used yeah. it quite a bit and done some lovely stuff with it. Um, yeah, I've always liked American retro stuff and American license plates. Um, yeah. And, the um, American license plates. I wanted something a little bit different that's um that's right and and like the whole like i think like to me this is like this and the other paper right the the last one that we have left those are like the, this is exactly like what you would picture um when you think oh andy skinner's um style to at least like to me this is like this is exactly what i picture <laughs> in my head it's watercolor now <laughs> um, it will be now it will be uh, Japanese ceramic painting yeah. <laughs> now I can add that as well <laughs> <laughs> so and but like rust and grunginess and like like really grungy stuff yeah I mean I, I've been I've been it's, doing the rust uh, thing for a, a long long time and yeah. I think I've got to the stage where I've mastered it Mm -hmm. uh, but it, it came a time for me where at the moment there's please don't have a go at me for this but i've just found a mixed media uh, why uh, why do i feel like you're breaking up with us uh, no with mixed media <laughs> i feel like i need a product to come out that really excites me uh-huh do you, do you know what i mean there's a lot of companies mm -hmm. bringing out products that have been around for a, a long time i'm just yeah. waiting that product unless I design it myself to come out <laughs> that kind well, of me. and I've, I've just I've always gone on different directions but I'll probably always come back to my mixed media uh, yeah yeah and my, my rust you you will and you will it, sometimes you just need a little break and you really yeah. don't get what you what you're saying about like you know yeah like there's nothing that new and exciting so you, you need something not at the moment but maybe yeah. you need to like come up with with something i may with creative expressions has been a bit of a low on me uh bringing out um <laughs> mediums and stuff over the last couple of years but I've, mm -hmm. I've got a lot of ideas so hopefully this year fingers crossed fingers, fingers crossed, crossed. You need to see some more new exciting stuff from andy skinner um okay and the last paper, the last paper. Oh, what do we have here? We have a mixed collage. And ah, uh, again, yeah, this is. <sighs> this is one of those ones you've got to look into. Yeah. To get all the detail that's in there. There's, there's gold leaf, there's text, there's, again, it's kind of a collage. It's ripped paper. Over there. Um, wait, 
here. I'm looking at the screen now, the paper. <laughs> yeah, so here, um, like, yeah, and lots of numbers. There's um, a flower in there. Yeah, there's lots of little hidden mm -hmm. pieces to make it interesting. This is the third paper that was used on the box. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, with the uh, the other two, with the two Japanese ones. Right, so on the box from Andy Skinner, you're going to have That's a, it. this this collab collaboration of these three papers. Um, I have to say, because I created a sample with um, this paper, right? I was wondering um, what paper it was used. I guessed it was that one, but it was uh -huh. hard to tell. Mm -hmm. And it wasn't until um, I applied it on and then I was sitting there painting those gold lines, right? Because yeah. uh, this whole collection really inspired me to kind of, uh, um, I guess, venture into, um, oh God, I forgot the word, kin, kin. Yeah, the, the gold, the ceramic type yes, style. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. Um, um, and as I was like sitting there painting out these lines, obviously I have all the time in the world to actually look at, like to really see the paper. And that's when I was like, oh my God, like there's so much to it. So much to it. Yeah. And sometimes when it's up on a website, um, like last year's papers, I suppose, sometimes when they're just up on a website, you won't see all that, that detail that's in them. Yeah. Yeah. Um, you have to get it in person you have to get up close in person yeah or get the people with the websites to have a close <laughs> <laughs> really 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 zoom in <laughs> um yeah you try and do it when like nobody's around because your family might question your sanity but like okay. is it just me or like because i know like you have to look close but when i'm looking at the paper on the screen like yeah i like there's a there's a face it it almost looks like a face that's i know just, i don't think it's meant to be but <laughs> i see it. It, it oh no it's just me it's just Please don't guys. <laughs> before i moved up where i am now in peterborough yeah um, the house in beaconsfield where my my studio was there um <laughs> it was in loft space and it had these annex windows looked out over to these tiled rooms on the other yeah. side of the house and they had moths and all sorts growing on them and, and yeah. when it rained you'd look out and I could see so many pictures you know yeah. faces like you're saying yeah. there yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And, and all yeah. sorts in there and it's a similar thing with that paper <laughs> you can kind of I'm looking now actually I can see 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 and I, I'm, I'm saying I like I'm not the only one. Look at the comments. Look at the comments. Oh, can you see? Can you see the um giraffe? Yeah. <laughs> can, I see, can I see the what? Giraffe. The giraffe. Um, and the monkey. Yeah. Monkey. <laughs> not yet. Give me a couple more hours. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and that is that is the full collection. Um. So um. What a beautiful, what a beautiful, beautiful collection of um, artwork do we have going on here, huh? What do you um, all think to I like the way you say beautiful. A beautiful. <laughs> yeah, sounds very English. <laughs> it's so beautiful. <laughs> um, yeah, so we have a set of beautiful. <laughs> oh, my God, I can't say it now. <laughs> <laughs> beautiful 12 papers um ranging from like slightly um oriental vibes um lots of florals lots of wallpapery um vibes all the way into like very 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 oriental feel um and then going back into a more traditional andy skinner style which oh this one by the way like really reminds me of you know what um tattered and torn paper from That's last right. year's yeah election. so mm -hmm. that was in my mind when i was doing that but uh -huh. see i knew it i knew it, it, it it's beautiful <laughs> it's beautiful um uh, 
Uh, oh, Kali's asking, are you going to show us what you made with this paper? Oh, keep an eye out. Keep an eye out. It's ready. It's done. It's made. Um, but um, keep yeah, an eye Yeah, we've all had to do sneak peeks over the last. Yes. Which is really. I made them all. I made them all. Because you, you want to show the whole piece. But I understand that, you know, you've got to have a little tease. You, well, you do. You have to. You have to be like, hey. You know, we have some interesting stuff coming, and we do. I mean, no word of a lie. So, um, okay, I have to be completely honest with you guys. I, I, I could not keep up with putting the names <laughs> on the wheel. <laughs> so, but thankfully, we're going to have, I have all of the comments um, saved um, here. So I'm going to go through the comments and put everybody's names on the wheel Um after the fact and you know what what we're going to do instead i think what we will do instead is instead of spinning the wheel right now because um i bet there's probably going to be quite a few people that um are not really around right now because it's still very early in the um in, on the on the um in the pacific time zone for example um so we will leave this up and until how about monday and we will do a draw on Monday. Maybe we will even throw in an extra pack. I don't know. I don't know. Um, of papers. Uh, so, because silly me, I did not. Um, I could not keep up with doing all of this, showing papers, looking at them, being like. <laughs> 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 and then um, also, um, so. We should have had Terry in the background, but I bet she's asleep still. <clears throat> um, so what do we have here? Um, great way to roll and let's uh let some get in on the replay, right? Exactly, exactly. Was it intentional? Um, or was it um, just a mistake? I don't know, we'll never know. As Teresa said, I like Mondays, an extra yeah, maybe an extra pack <gasps> and maybe some of my projects too. Oh, there you go. So it's I think so. I think that is a really, really good idea. So, um, again, before we wrap this up, because um, you're because bored. We've now looked at all of them. <laughs> before we wrap this up, just a quick again recap. So the papers are now available um, in everywhere or should be with all of their retail, all of the retailers uh, that will carry them. And if not, then they are on their way to the retailers, but you should be able to go and purchase them. The um, retailer locator link is just posted in the comments. So if you would like to find one in your area, wherever you are, check out that link. Also go to Andy Skinner's website and check out more of his stuff, of what he does um, there on andyskinner.co.uk. Um, and thank you so much, Andy, for- Yeah, thanks everybody um, for, for turning up. Uh, yeah, this was fun. I haven't done this for a year. I know, I know. It, it needs to become a tradition at this yeah, point. Definitely. At this point, <laughs> definitely. Um, and yeah, so continue tagging, continue sharing um, this live stream, and all of the um, entries will be um, subject to a giveaway. Words are not wording anymore. <laughs> He's lost it. I've lost I it. Okay. Take over. <laughs> um, yeah, we'll be put all of the people that enter in the giveaway. Um, we'll be, we'll have their names on the wheel. I can't talk anymore. We'll have their names on the wheel. I will spin the wheel on Monday, probably in a quick live stream, and um, we will be giving away two packs of two full packs of the full collection and a um, lovely box from Andy Skinner and one of the projects from Teresa Renee Art, who is, of course, decoupage queen herself. Um, and yeah, thank you, everybody. Andy, any last words? No, before... 
it really i'm i'm bored now but um oh, <laughs> you know what you know what I'm going to be having yeah, look out over the next couple of weeks for all the samples that everybody's made. Um, Absolutely. And hopefully that can inspire you a bit. Exactly, yes. And so get the papers, get creating, and show us what you make so that we yeah. also can get inspired the other way around, you know. Yeah. Um, Thank you for all the lovely comments as well. Absolutely. Thank you, everybody, for being here. And we will catch you all later. And